guys, what's up and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I am filming a Princess Polly try on haul for autumn. Oh my gosh, I have taken out these items and shot them in the city and like worn them just to be that Pinterest aesthetic girl and they are so nice. You guys would love them and I feel like they reflect autumn so perfectly. So without further ado, let's just jump right into the video. So thinking guys I was thinking these items would be perfect for school or uni college whatever you want to call it because they are so cute but warm and totally wearable so let me show you guys this very first item I got and it is these really really cute oversized knit sweater it is so soft and warm and I love it so much because I went and shot these outfits on like a pretty cold day and if you know Melbourne you know it is literally like a wind tunnel the city is so windy and it can be really cold but i wore this and it was so nice and warm and so cozy and i was just living my best life in it and i feel like it is that perfect combination of cozy and cute it can be warm but still look really stylish and can we just talk about how aesthetic this haul is going to be because i've seen these everywhere on my pinterest you know for that autumn european girl aesthetic that's what i'm trying to embody this autumn so this one is amazing. It is perfect, can go with a mini skirt, can go with jeans, leather pants. I have been wanting to stock up on my knits and really get in the knit game because when it comes to winter, these bad boys are perfect for layering. I have another surprise and it's a discount code. You can use my discount code LOVECA for 20% off. I also want to mention that if you spend over $60 on Princess Polly, then they will give you free express shipping and I say this in every video but the free express shipping is so beautiful it is such a game changer because my order literally comes the next day and if you know me I am one of the most impatient people ever so I love it when I get speedy delivery this is the very first item it's kind of giving like beige vanilla girl aesthetic vibes what's your favorite aesthetic let me know down in the comments below no haul is ever complete without getting not only tops but bottoms as well so I got this really cute I always struggle with this word this really cute skirt. It is actually really nice and thick. It's like this felt material and it's got a really nice little print on it with a little zip on the side. This is amazing. It is so flattering as well. I feel like it is definitely a bit more of like a high-waisted skirt. This bad boy isn't too short, which is great because like short skirts are cute and all, like those mini ones, but they only look really cute in pictures. Like they're not exactly super wearable and you know when you're out in the public and stuff like that, you kind of want to feel safe. It will match with majority of the items I'm going to show you in this haul. I'm really happy I got this and also how cute would this be with stockings. Another thing I love about this is that you can pair it with both like a lighter aesthetic or a darker so like black and white. I thought I would change it up a bit and get this holy knit crochet sweater. You guys I have been loving this vibe. It is so cute and I feel like this can just go with any season like summer, spring, autumn, winter and I've seen it all over Pinterest. I swear this is like viral. The color is to die for. This red is so gorgeous and so rich. I think you'd call it like burgundy and it is perfect for layering. I am trying to up my layering game. Obviously summer's not the best time to try and layer because you will be boiling hot and like sweating and all that. Autumn is the time for layering to shine and I just think there are so many opportunities and so many cute outfits you could create with this. It's just so nice to chuck it on over the top of like a bando top or like a shirt or something and you can pair it with so many different types of bottoms like a skirt, mini skirt, cargo long skirt, those denim ones, cargo pants, jeans and this color. Tell me guys am I wrong but doesn't it scream autumn? I never usually wear red either like I'm not a red person but I think this color is a bit more muted so that I like it more. So check this out right. I don't know if you can see it but my forehead is suffering because I have all these pimples like a big one here and another big one there they're big and because they're in my t-zone they actually really hurt whenever I raise my eyebrows like that and I am quite an expressive person so I always go like and it hurts but I think the concealer did a pretty good job of covering it up okay something else I want to talk about is the outfit I have on I have this gorgeous knit 
first. I really went hard with the knits in this haul and I have got you covered because the knits are amazing. I love knits so much. This print, it's so nice. It's really soft. It's the perfect like oversized but crop kind of vibe and it's so good with layering. Like I just chucked on a white long sleeve collar button up thing magic underneath. I wore this out yesterday to go eat Korean food in the city. One, it was so delicious. Like you guys should check out my little TikTok on it because it's kind of funny. And two, it kept me really nice and warm and I just wore it by itself so I didn't have anything underneath. So I think it's a perfect transseasonal piece. Gosh, I sound like a fashion you know, like where it's warm but cold and the day starts off really cold but then it warms up. I eat Melbourne and this piece would be perfect because it'll keep you warm but you won't be sweating too much. I'm kind of really going for the proper vibe. Then I want to show you guys the most flattering skirt ever. Look at the detailing on this skirt. So I've got these like really cute little buckle dupes. <laughs> Dupe. They are so cute and this detailing just ties the whole skirt together and completely changes it from your normal pleated skirt into something more funky so I love it. This skirt is more of a high-waisted skirt on me. A funny thing about this skirt, you think it's one whole piece but it's not like it. But here it's like open a little bit so you gotta be a little bit careful when the wind blows keep your hands and your legs <laughs> at least you'll flash somebody and they'll probably be scarred for life. You know what I'm picturing guys? I'm picturing this outfit on the streets of Paris or like the cobblestones in Europe. Oh my lord that is just such a vibe and that is what I'm trying to envision so hopefully we're manifesting something when we're wearing this outfit. You know what, I'm gonna let you in on a little thought that I've been thinking. So, towards the end of summer, I always get so, so excited for colder weather. And I don't know if that's just because I can layer more and dress like cuter, or the fact that it's probably easier to go out because I'm not sweating and don't have the risk of getting burnt or whatever, you know, because Australian sun is so harsh. I don't even know where I was going with that, except for the fact that we're not getting colder weather and I really, really want it to be cold soon so I can wear more of these outfits out. So you guys remember the very first item I showed you, that really cute knit sweater? Well, I wasn't lying when I said I really got into the knits in this haul because I got that exact same sweater but in this gorgeous burgundy shade. When I saw this on the site in their new in section, I was like, I have to take it. Like, it's coming home with me because the colour is so so all to me and so vibey and I want to try something new like I want to experiment with a new color and new kind of style so I was like why not do this like it's not too in your face it's still really flattering it's a heavy item but not uncomfortably heavy and it's really warm super super cute there's one thing about it though it leaves a lot of this like red dust on my clothes so like when I put it over this top because that's how I want to wear it and like this top is what it leaves like a whole layer of red dust on it so you gotta have one of those sticky rolls but that could also be due to the fact that I haven't washed it if you're gonna get the knit make sure you wash them first before you chuck them on over a white top don't judge me don't judge me because I haven't washed it because I can't I don't have time to wash it I really want to show you guys this haul and take some really cute insta pics and stuff like that so I get super excited and I don't have time to wait for it to dry but yeah these knits are so versatile because you can wear them when you go out you can wear them for like a lunch or a coffee or a brunch day you can wear them to uni and then you can also just chuck them on over wets at home and still have that cozy comfy vibe. I shot this knit in an art gallery. It is giving. Can't wait to edit those pics and show you. They'll be up on my Instagram very very soon so keep an eye out for that. Last but not least is this gorgeous black high-waisted pleated skirt. It's a mini skirt. This one is so flattering and it's cut differently like more different than any other mini skirt I own. Let me tell you something. There's something in this skirt that makes it look so beautiful on. The way that it's high-waisted but flares out it really accentuates your hip and it makes it look so good it makes you look tall like you have an hourglass figure like a bombastic body the other thing that i love about this skirt is that it is not so short like it falls mid thigh on me and it is such a comfy length where i know i'm not gonna be flashing anyone and i can walk at ease and that concludes my princess polly haul i really hope you guys enjoyed watching i always love working with princess polly because they always have such cute pieces that make a really nice outfit and I always get so excited to show you their pieces because I love them so much so thank you to Princess Polly for working with me again make sure you leave a comment letting me know which piece from this haul is your favorite and don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video bye